welcome to this tutorial i'm going to teach you um the auto manipulation you can call it you can call it photo marking all right so here are what i trying to get to form this form you can see it here to form this form okay so i'm going to start this form all right let's get started now So this, 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 so this is a pizza lab in Malaysia. I'm using it. Does it have it? The link is in the description below. Just import the the for the image which is on the description below. It's on the description below. If you don't have it, so please subscribe to my channel to receive more video on graphic design and video editing. So of the first globe, this is globe. You can see it has a white background. Okay, so here is how I did it. So. Uh, enlarge it enlarge it all right so this is the enlargement so just bend it like this the way it stand so let me show you the degree so that you can notice it so it's 71 degree that's plus 71 degree okay so the next thing is that make sure your background should be white so come here so your background to be white all right just pure white or you 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 stick the white of this one so you can see that nobody noticed that that one is white and i want it to be white so that um i don't want to remove the background actually so let's enlarge this a little bit and try now you like it so the next is that we'll bring the remaining image so i will bring the all the image of the chair and then the water okay all the images are in the description please subscribe to this channel don't forget to subscribe and click the bell button so that you can receive notification anytime i upload a video like this so here are all the uh, picture below okay the next is that just lock the bulb home then this one let's unsave the fish first then bring this one in here so you can see the way you can see the way the bulb is that i want this one to like the water is flowing out of it like this okay so this is how i want it to be so what we have to use is to use the uh the marks here that's the marks this one we're going to use this marks here so that's it so if you don't have any knowledge on closer this mask i did a video on how to do a photo masking so I explained, I explained it very well there so you can watch the video share the, the description below to know the video so here is it so we are going to max it now here so we are going to move it so I am going to move it here so just set it at the shapes of this bulb okay on it then make sure you put it on out here yeah, sorry, bit on out here. Nine six over. So you just follow this thing, enlarge it so that you can see it very well. So once you enlarge it, you are able to see it, everything. So what you have to do is that you have to merge it with this one. Okay. Then click on the plus there to see what you are doing. All right. So this one now. So make sure you follow this line so i'm going to balance it here now so all right so let's see it and this one Actually, if you don't understand it very well, you can click on the on the in here so that you can see your your masking. So if all for use in, that's I think that's first I want to uh, call for use. So after you click on this in, so that you can see it the line this line very well, you be able to see the line very well more than when you use out.
Stelle. One doesn't need like that, like that. You can balance it everywhere. Alright, so let's click on the out, then let's zoom it back and see it. So you can see it that it still remains more. I will down here. Just a little bit there. So, sorry. So click on the in. On the out. So just keep on um, pressing it. So I am going to press it in a little by little. So you press it so that you can see. Then make sure the water splash is up to the line of the bulb at least a little bit so it cover the the bulb line so we can recover it then you keep on checking that you are doing it okay so that's how you check it so once it's perfect like that so you are good we have to perfect it so that it should be more because if it if the water starts past to the line of the bulb it look more weak so what you have to do is that we should go to the uh, max back to edit it uh, to be perfect. So, so here is the way I adjust it. You can see the way I adjust it like that. I just adjust. So the next thing that we do is that just load the opacity of the of the water so that it can look implemented. Yeah, let's see. It. So here is it. You can see the way it's balancing. So actually, she tried to do it very well. So because of the tutorial, so let's leave it like this. So the next is that we we'll bring our ship. Let's lock this on. Bring the ship. Uh, the fish go the ship. So it's on the description right. below. So make it low. So to make it very small, more small, so that it's doing leak, leak one very big. So here is it. So. Rotate, let's make it where, yeah, 18. So copy it again, just use this one so that it's very fast. Okay, put another one there, you can see, just make it low, more low. So another one. So you can put as many as you like. You can even make this somewhat lower, okay? Just like the fishes in water. So we are done with it. So the next thing that remains to make it more real is to add shadow. And we need the shadow of this bulb. So just copy the bulb here. Copy it. You can see what I click to copy it here. Shadow, just copy it. So after you are done with the copy, go to uh but erase color so just click on automatically you should remove white color so that's tolerance thing here's what we need here so just bring it here this is the balance so we want to use this one for our shadow okay so just what we have to do next is to use the 3d hex just to rotate it okay. so we want it to Okay, so you can see 22 minus 15. Nice one. So let me use this one to be controlling it. Alright, it's balanced. So I'm going to now rotate it. 
we are done here so yeah so here is what we are going to rotate here so after that we are going to blow the opacity let's blow the opacity all right yeah. Wow. Okay, the opacity is okay uh, using the law of uh, shadow so you can see that it's balanced very well so then next is that you just erase the part of it just erase it like this erase the part of the shadow because of the way we put the water there so let's see yeah so here is it so it's balanced so we are done with it so then you can match everything together as you like so you can enlarge it please before you go subscribe to my channel to see more videos on god and video please subscribe